They ain't laying this guy giving up from blue tops like Mars Simpson, just hard discipline, pot simmering, cooking up, no rocks in the pan, watching the plan for him in the sand, bidding castles out of thoughts in our head, late nights, no sleep in my bed, trying to see my dreams manifest. Look at that, now look at that, we nice. Put the past on ice, I was bad like Mike, uh, now I'm good like Kendra said, boy, we gon' be alright. Uh, I just double my price, yeah, I get love on sight, that's the only love I like. Look at that, we nice. Hey, welcome back to another video. I know it hasn't been that long, I think about a week or so. Going back out again to try to troll. The goal is never really to troll for rockfish. Unfortunately, most of the places around here I end up having to troll. So the goal is really just to go out, troll a little bit, find a location where there's rockfish, and then hopefully just set up and cast either a snap jig or just cast and retrieve or get top water. Most of the time you're stuck with trolling because they're not schooled up right now. In the past, I've had it where they're schooled up and you could just cast into them and uh, reel them in. But the goal is definitely rockfish. Hoping since the sun's out that we'll have a bite and then going into the evening, maybe we'll even have a little bit of a top water bite, which would be nice to see. I'm not expecting too much. I'm not keeping any fish today. Just trying to get on whatever I can. If I can get in the 20s for size wise, that'd be great. I don't think I'll get into the 30s. 20 would be fine for me just to have a little fun and then just catch and release uh, safely back to the water. But if you haven't done so already, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Please make sure you give this video a thumbs thumbs up and make sure you hit that notification bell. Anybody that's subscribed to the channel recently, thanks for joining the channel. I do giveaways. Every time I get 100 subscribers, next milestone would be 500 subscribers. I think I'm at like 470 right now. Thanks again for watching. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Big Yacker, All right. out. We're out on the water here. A little bit sportier than I'd like, but I don't know. If we can get on some fish, I guess it really won't matter. And the uh, wind's not supposed to pick up any more than it currently is. The wind's coming from the northwest, which is never a favorable wind as far as the uh, temperature's concerned, but it's still in the mid 60s, I think. So we're good for now. We have an incoming tide till for another couple hours, I think it said. So that's also good. Hopefully we'll get on those fish out here in normal spots. And we got our homemade, homemade uh, lure here. I think this is my last one, so I lose this one. I gotta get some more from my brother-in-law, Brian, but these things are sweet. Fish on. Fish on already. There we go. Fish on already, baby. I feel like I'm doubling up sometimes, but I don't think I am. Alright. Yeah. I think it's stuck on the ground on that one. Not a bad little fish. Not a bad little fish. Not a bad little fish. Probably about a 12. Yeah, it's a good one. Jumped out of the water on that one. Jumped out of the water on that one. Swim towards me. All right, all right, all right, all right. Again, definitely fish all over here. It's nice actually just trolling the one rod. Not to about tangling anything else, it's a small one. So 
when I start reeling in, I turn into the wave so I don't get side swiped. Another small one. It's all right. I don't want to get side swiped by a wave, so. small baby fish around here today folks we got baby fish here smallest one of the day smallest one of the day got as big as a lure here tiny one all right see you buddy all right, now if you look on the screen here, you got on the left and the right, that's all the structure. That's my spot that I have marked. I'm like literally right on top of that spot. Okay, here's a zoomed in picture of the fish finder. And let me provide some uh, context here. So on the left side of the fish finder itself, uh, this side over here, you'll see this is the side scan imaging. So in the middle is where my kayak is. And then this is everything to the left and to the right of the kayak. The top right here you'll see is a map. And the bottom right is uh, the down scan. So this fish finder, you can have, I think, three or four different, actually four different screens if you wanted to, but I chose to have three here because um, I find that the bigger screen having the side scan is more beneficial. And then anything on the down scan and then the map, I kind of know where I'm at already. Um, it's a little bit fuzzy and hard to see here, but I do have a mark on the map actually right here. Um, and this is what I'm actually going over now. Um, that's the beginning of what you see here. So here is um, the, this is all the structure I was referring to where you'll see me catch some fish from time to time. This line here is the beginning of that structure, which is very much equivalent to the line right here, which is the beginning of the structure. And that would be all of this here. And then here, down here on the left, uh, bottom here, that's equivalent to the flat, basically flat bottom, no structure. And that's all this area that I just passed over here. So as you see here, when you do the fit, when you have a fish finder and you have a down scan, this is all the new material that you're going over right here as you go over it, right? So this is like the recorded right here. Same thing here. Um, everything up here is the new, um, bottom that I'm going over and seeing on my side scan. And then this here is everything that we just had passed, which would be equivalent to right here. So hopefully that provides you a little bit of context as I show you the fish finder as I'm going over the structure. And then hopefully we catch some fish as we're going over that structure as well, because that's where I had been catching it in the past. So I hope you enjoyed this tutori tutorial. Feel free to leave a comment in the comment section down below if you have any further questions. But this is my, my structured spot all around this structure. Oh, 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 yeah, there you go. That's this fish. And just like clockwork, when you get on that structure, you usually run in the fish. It's a little bit better of a fish, better quality wise compared to the ones I have before. Oh, yeah, definitely better quality. willing to bet that's a short keeper but like I said not keeping anything today and this would be really short to keep if I could maybe that's probably 19 but it's very skinny very skinny 19 hey buddy thank you for playing oh that's a hard hit right there hard hit all right 
take this. It's not feeling as big as it did before. All right, all right, all right. Another fish. No shortage of fish today, it's just quality is not there. It's quantity tons, quality not so much. the best quality today so far but I think it's matching up with the the best one I caught of the day so far dang Woo. Woo. the importance of staying into the waves Actually, the best fish of the day. Pretty good size. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh man. Holy crap. I'm just gonna have to measure him just to see how big he is, because this is in the mid 20s. I'm thinking. I'm thinking mid 20s. fish right here. Right. I know it hit pretty hard, but I need to choke the whole thing here. A good sized fish right here. Oh, if I was keeping. Oh, 26. All right. Can't be mad at that. Can't be mad at that. 26 inch fish right there, baby. 26. Quality compared to the last one. A little heavier, but not big.
right. Can't be mad at that. Can't be mad at that. 26 inch fish right there, baby. 26. A big behemoth. Take. Turn everything I talked about. Another one. Not really big, but maybe another one around here somewhere. All right. Get the pressure off. All right, so thanks for watching. I'm gonna do the outro now before it gets dark, um, but thanks for watching. Got on some rock today. The bite's eating up. The weather's finally calmed down. So I'm gonna try to stick it out for a little bit until it gets dark. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you liked the video. I had to troll around again. I did get to some areas where I tried casting. I got a couple hits, but I never actually got any bites that stuck. Still waiting for the fish to pop up and do some blitzing. Hopefully on the way back, maybe I'll be able to get some top water. I don't know. They still keep hitting that the homemade lure that my brother-in-law Brian made me. Shout out to Brian and thanks for that lure, man. Gotta make some more of those. They are money here in the bay. I caught 26 inch on that lure as well. So again, end of the month, I'm going to New York. Hopefully get on some blackfish. Thanks for watching the channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already subscribed to the channel. Give this video a thumbs up and hit that notification bell. Thanks again for watching. Big Yacker out. I was bad like Mike. Uh. Look at them, you're time for